The Georgia Sports Hall of Fame is an important part of the state, and as such, you might expect to find it in somewhere like Atlanta, where so many other important landmarks and tourist destinations are found. But it's for that very reason that instead, the hall is located here in Macon. Well, it started out in Atlanta in 1956 as the high school sports hall of fame. It was a way to recognize high school coaches and players in Georgia and their accomplishments. Um, and then it, in the 90s, it got to the point where they needed a place um, to uh, put all this. So the Music Hall of Fame, Georgia Music Hall of Fame, was brought to make it. Then they had the idea to also bring the Sports Hall of Fame because they could have bookend museums that would build, be, be built very close to each other and could sort of draw off of each other. And if you look at the uh, demographics, uh, we're being in the central uh, part of the state probably had as much to do with it being brought here as anything. Basically, it got lost in Atlanta in the, in the small space that they used there for the Georgia Sports Hall of Fame at the time. And so we had an opportunity and built the largest uh, bricks and mortar building for a sports hall of fame in the nation with 43,000 square feet. There was a feeling that even though the hall of fame induction, the sports hall of fame induction was always in Atlanta, it was always a big deal, um, that by having a physical building, a museum in Macon, it would, um, not just be another attraction. See, Atlanta is full of so many things that they they had the they had the feeling that it would just be another attraction in in Atlanta, and it would kind of get lost, and perhaps it would have. 